Welcome to the Lifetime Assembly channel. My name is John, and today I'm going to help you assemble your metal frame swing set. Before we get started, make sure the model number of your swing set is listed in the description below. This video will follow the steps outlined in the assembly manual that comes with the swing set, so if you've already begun and need help on a specific step, check the comments or description below for a timestamp associated with each step. Now let's take a look at what comes inside the box. There are steps within this assembly that require more than one person, so be sure to have at least one other adult available to help. Before we get into the assembly process, let's take a look at the tools you'll need to complete the job. You'll need a hammer, a half inch wrench, two 3 16 Allen keys, which are included, a ladder, and safety glasses. To make this easier, we're going to use a 3 16 hex head socket and a drill. You may see us use an impact driver. If you decide to use one as well, be sure not to over torque or over tighten the hardware. When building your swing set, make sure to choose a level area free from obstructions, at least seven feet from buildings, streets, fences, or any other object. Also, to reduce the risk of injury, it's important that you prepare a shock absorbing surface to build your swing set on, such as wood chips or a cycle rubber mulch. This video will focus on the assembly of the swing set and not the shock absorbing surface. So it's important that you refer to your assembly manual to review the safety instructions for this build. This video is meant to be used as a companion to the assembly manual and not a direct replacement. So for the best results, make sure to have the assembly manual on hand during the build. All right, let's get started. Slide the outer swing bar into either end of the middle swing bar, making sure that the pendulum brackets are all on the same side and secure with the hardware. Be careful not to over tighten this hardware. Repeat the previous step for the other outer swing bar. Attach a pendulum to each bracket on the swing bars, making sure not to over tighten the hardware because you want the pendulums to swing freely. The swing legs consist of two poles, the upper pole and the bottom pole. The bottom pole has one square hole at the end and the upper pole has two round holes at the end. Slide the upper pole onto the bottom pole, line up the holes and then secure through the lower hole. Repeat the previous step three more times for a total of four legs. Insert two upper poles into the swing bar, line up the holes, and secure with the hardware.
Repeat the previous steps for the other two legs. Attach a turn bar to the outside of the legs to the upper set of holes that we left open earlier. Repeat for the other side. Remember, it's important that the turn bars are on the outside of the swing legs. Attach your foot cap to the bottom of the pole, making sure the foot cap is oriented like this. Only finger tighten this hardware for now. Repeat for the other side. The bolt you just inserted has a hole in the middle of it. Insert this end of the anchor into the hole and then tug on it to lock it into place. Do this for the other leg as well. With the help of another person, flip the assembly over, lay the other legs on the ground, and then attach your foot caps and anchors using the same method as before. With the help of another person, lift the assembly up onto its feet. Place the forked end of the anchoring rod into the anchor. Place the anchor near the end of the foot cap and drive into the ground until the cable is tight. Since we're inside, we're not gonna be able to do this, but it's important that you do. Repeat this step for each anchor on the legs. Once the anchor is in the ground, remove any slack by twisting this bolt, and then once it's tight, push it into the pole and tighten from the other side. Make sure to do this for each leg. Now you can go ahead and add the swings to the pendulums. Thank you for watching this video on how to assemble your lifetime metal frame swing set. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up. For more content like this, subscribe to our channel. If you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to our customer service team and check out our other awesome products at lifetime.com.